Six years ago, Ivan Popov made Australian sporting history. Come August, he's hoping to do it again. He broke a 30-year gold medal drought for Australia at the New Delhi Commonwealth Games in Greco-Roman wrestling. With his name in the history books, some still had trouble placing the face. Some of them like thinking that I'm a basketball player or footy player, <laughs> but not definitely a wrestler. It was a dream that started between two brothers in Siberia, Russia, who longed for a wrestler's most identifiable feature. The first wish we had are broken ears. If you've got a broken ear, it's a business card. So yeah, now I've got broken ears, perfect, so I'm going to Olympics. Fulfilling a family legacy. His father won Olympic bronze for Russia in 1988. Brother Vladimir, also a national titleist, missed out on qualifying for Rio after a neck injury. But he says Ivan's victory is his victory. It doesn't matter who's going to go myself or Ivan. It's like uh, we've always been so close that we're just one, one person. One person who won't be watching is Ivan's wife, Olga. What they're doing, uh, it's sort of scary. After missing selection for the London Games in 2012, Popov took a break from wrestling to marry the love of his life. Now with training back in full gear, Mrs Popov is back to feeding a heavyweight wrestler. It's like we have family not from two people, from ten people. Popov earned his ticket to Rio, winning successive national titles in 2015 and 2016. The Siberian-born athlete's current form reigniting hopes that he'll be the first Australian Greco-Roman wrestler to bring home the silverware. I might even cry in a good way. <laughs> and if that medal happens to be Australia's first wrestling gold, he won't be the only one. I'll try to bring our medal for you guys, for all of you, for all of Australia. Abby Dinham, SBS World News.